My neck is a different color, but I don't care. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi. I'm in my kitchen, but I have a few things. You can't see that yet. Okay, hold on. So, uh, we are in my kitchen. Halloween is coming up. I kind of have my costume made up already. Only thing is, is that I really want some red heels, but I don't want to go buy a new pair. I saw something on YouTube about like bleaching shoes, and then you could like dye them your own color. So I was like, okay. So what I've decided to do is dye my Louboutins red. So I have a pair of, well, they were black. Um, now they're the bleach color. And so this is just one coat. I just want to see if it would work first. I don't have footage of that. So it still is too dark for to take the red color, so I do need to go a little bit lighter with it. I don't know of anyone that actually bleach dyed their Louboutin. So let's see what happens, and if you wanna see how this turns out, then keep on watching. Okay, so what I need to do is I need to bleach it a little bit more. I'm just gonna pour it on there and see what happens. Oh my God, these fumes are so strong. I don't know why it's foaming up like that. It's kind of weird. <coughs> oh my god, these chemicals are gnarly. Oh god, I gotta take this stuff out. Okay, I'll be back. <coughs> oh my god. I have them in the sun right now. Let's let it dry out a little bit and we will come back and see what it looks like. Two hours later. Um, I had to move into the backyard because the front yard sun was kind of going down. As you can tell, they are getting a lot lighter, which means hopefully the coloring of the red will hold a lot better. This might be a two day process, so we will see. So yes, might go into like a tomorrow thing. Um, I can't do anything until that dries. So I do have some dye products. Um, I have this Rit, right? 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 Rit? Right, let's go hit Terrace Chase and those for the bit. They have the pit. Right, it. Yeah. But it's it, so it'd be Rit. Oh, I just got that stuck to my thumb. The next day. It did take a little bit for it to dry, but um, it is pretty it is pretty light. Um, I got it light in some areas. It's still kind of dark. I don't really know what that will do. But I honestly, I'm just like very impatient. I just think that we should just go ahead and dye it. So I have this dye that I was talking about, and then I have this like little spray dye. So I feel like I could just like spray wherever um, isn't as red. You know, just like spray over it. I don't know. I mean, it says to do like boiling water, heat the stove top to 180. I mean, my faucet water gets really hot. I think we should just do that. It says use one bottle for two pounds of dry fabric. I don't know if that's two pounds or not. And I'm just gonna put it in each shoe. I don't have a big enough pot for both of them. Or kind of is dying my fingers now. Yeah, 30 minutes. So I guess we'll just leave that one in for 30 minutes. It keeps on rising. I'm gonna need it to stop rising. Sink to the bottom like the Titanic. My shoe doesn't want to sink. Okay, so this is how I currently have them. I have this one propped like that. It won't fit all the way into the bucket. And then this one right here is just kind of like slumped over. I will come back in 30 minutes and see what they look like. Okay, so it's been a little bit past 30 minutes. Um, I had to like flip the shoes over so they get the top part because my buckets aren't big enough. I gotta see what to do next. I don't know what to do next. Okay, 30 minutes or until Reese's Desire color shade. Well, it's wet. I don't know what color it is. Guess it's time to rinse. Time on time. Time on time. So this is what it looks like right now, but it's wet. I guess we'll see like what it looks like whenever it dries. I mean, that's a pretty color red. That's actually kind of demonic looking. The shoes are outside right now. The little sun bath area. I don't know if you can tell. I mean, it's kind of got like a hint of red, but like they're wet right now, so I just need to let them dry. So I'm gonna let them dry and just see how they turn out. Well, that didn't do shit. Really? They ain't red for shit. They're still kind of like an orangey color. Um, I'm gonna let them dry just a little bit more and then I'm gonna try using this and see how it turns out. Ah! 
Ah. So this is as best as it's gonna get. Um, as best as best as. as this is as best as it's going to get. There we go. So yeah, they were black. Now they're this like weird orange red color. I don't know. I ran out of that can of fabric spray, and this is all I could do is this shoe. And as you can tell, like some of it's red, some of it's not. Kids at home, don't bleach your shoes unless you know what the hell you're doing because I just ruined my pair of Louboutins. <laughs> oh well, shit happens. Don't forget to subscribe to um, our channel. Don't forget to hit that notification button. <laughs> See you next time, bye. I mean, why couldn't it just all have been that color? Like, I just needed everything to, oh, that's still sticky. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Like, I just needed it all to be that color. But now it's, like, really stiff. It's like I spray painted it. <laughs> I can't. Uh, that is so funny. Oh, well. <laughs>